Good afternoon, Vikings. I'm Riley Dominey. And I'm Ace Roche. And this is the Ryan High Norseman Broadcasting. Early in October, orchestra members auditioned for the All Region Orchestra. Congratulations to Mia Garza, Ariana Pena, Sergio Gallegos, Ruth De Leon, and Milan Bowers for making the Region 8 Orchestra on violin. October's Lunch and Learn is about debunking movie science. It will take place tomorrow in room 1200 during all three lunches. If any students are interested in developing leadership skills while making a difference in the school and community, they are invited to join VCOT. Students can pick up an application in room 3129, 2113, 3221, or 3227, or use the QR code found on flyers around campus. I'm looking for a yellow bone, long hair star, star. thick and hips come get in my car. The freshman class will be electing their class council tomorrow, October 20th. All members must have at least a 2.0 GPA to be eligible. UIL academics practices are starting now. Students can participate in different academic events and be a part of the school team and district competition. Students also have the opportunity to earn a letter jacket through participation. Each event is coached by a different BHS teacher, but for general questions, please contact Mrs. Rebecca Dominey in room 6160 or scan the QR code here to express interest in one of the events. The application deadline for a summer internship with the NASA High School Aerospace Scholars is Thursday, October 20th. For more information, go to their website at www.nasa.gov has. Next week is Red Ribbon Week. The dress up days are as follows. Monday, teaming up against, against drugs. Wear your favorite team shirt or jersey. Tuesday, give drugs and alcohol the boot. Wear Western wear boots and cowboy hats. Wednesday, double up against alcohol and drugs. Twin day. Thursday, scare alcohol and drugs away. Trunk or treat costumes, but no face mask. Friday, Vikings don't do drugs. Wear Go Big Blue or Viking Spirit t-shirts. Hobby Youth Leadership State Seminars are registering current sophomores for the summer of 2023. If you are interested, please contact Mr. Essies by Friday, October 21st. The Brasses Valley College and Career Night is scheduled for Monday, October 24th from 6 to 8 at the Brazos Center. The evening will focus on educational opportunities for both college and the workforce brown students where they will be able to meet with a variety of college and work workforce representatives. Participation is free and open to all high school students. The North Dragons D&D Club will meet again on Thursday, October 27th at room 6160. Dues are $20 and include a club shirt and must be paid by the October 27th meeting. Students can also stop by room 6160 anytime to make a payment. Last week, the cross-country team competed at District in Pflugerville. Senior Andrew Shields earned 8th place and qualified for Region, while also earning 1st Team All-District Honors, and Brian Ybarra was named 2nd Team All-District. JV football team played a good Weiss team last Thursday and came out on the losing side of a tough battle. The JV football team is back in action Thursday night at Merrill Green Stadium. The varsity football team played the Wise Wolves at Merrill Green Stadium Friday night and lost 13 to 38, moving their record to four and three overall and one and two in district. Scoring for the Vikings were Creed Pierce on quarterback sneak and Terrence Lewis on a 53 yard run. Defensively, Tyson Turner had an interception. The Vikings look to get back on track versus the Midway Panthers this Friday in Waco. Keep sending us your pictures. The yearbook is currently looking for pictures of kids hanging out with friends on the weekends and kids at their jobs. We would also love screen caps of your Be Real posts. You can submit by following the link on the BHS Northman website, by typing the direct link into your browser, or by using the QR code here. Here are a few of the pictures sent into us this week. That's all the announcements we have for today. Thank you for joining us and please stay tuned for a short video made by debate about this month's EA characteristic, tolerance. Tolerance. Noun. The ability or practice of tolerating, an acceptance of or patience with the beliefs, opinions or practices of others, a lack of bigotry. So I have my sign. I think at some point you're gonna get the picture of it, but 
It was left here by the teacher before me. This is my first year at Bryan High. And it just says, everyone is welcome here. And uh, it has uh, a rainbow at one end and all sorts of different, I suppose you'd say, flesh tones in the middle. And then um, uh, the, the trans flag at the other end. And they're all in, the, in hearts. And um, when I first pulled that out, I thought, do I want to display this in such a way that it's going to maybe open a can of worms for me or for somebody else or that it might offend someone? But then I realized that the message was too important and that I believed in it too much to put it away. And so now it's, it's on the center of my desk. I want everybody to feel welcome here. I want my children to feel welcome wherever they are uh, on campuses in Bryan ISD. I want people to feel welcome at my home. And to me, that's, I hope, the epitome of tolerance is making somebody feel welcome and that they can be themselves in your presence and, uh, and feel appreciated and like they belong.